rather than having um, a strong, united uh, national movement, you have regional movements. So before Nigeria was um, a federation of 36 states, at the time of independence, it was divided into three regions. So you have the northern region, which is uh, geographically much bigger, and the eastern region and the, the western region. Rather than having um, a set of national actors which are cultivating a national identity and working to build some kind of strong national government, you have regional political parties and regional political leaders which are jockeying um, with one another um, you know, for what the independent government is going to look like. Right? So some political leaders were very much in favor of a strong national government while others um, were more wary of a strong national government and wanted to have strong regional assemblies and regional governments right? that really took over the bulk of governing. And this has played out after independence as well. Um, and these regional divides still broadly exist between the Southwest and the, the Southeast and the North. So this has played over, um, you know, the independence movement, which has you know, been a response to colonial rule, has played over into the trajectory of Nigeria's um, independent history.